the Seth Rollins heel turn. So, Seth Rollins has officially turned heel. Whew, so let's talk about it. Seth Rollins, he has been a great guy. You know, he's been awesome in the ring. He's done some good stuff, but sometimes bad. But Seth Rollins, I think it was just the perfect time for him to go heel. Because if you look at him, he's been booked so much lately that he's turning into the next Roman Reigns. He is the next Roman Reigns. And I really do think that it's a good thing to turn him heel because Seth as a face is over is like not overrated. It's just boring at, at a time. Like you gotta stop booking him that much. That's all I'm trying to say. Like Seth Rollins as a face, it's good, but don't overbook him. Like don't make him go after the title so many times. Any championship. Like let him be like Roman Reigns. Like let him take a break for a bit, and then yeah, you know he'll he'll get it up. But yeah. So Seth Rollins, he's right here. Right there. He is officially turned heel. So what's next for him? Well, he'll be involved in a feud with Kevin Owens, possibly. Or he'll just be as a heel. Like, when people turn heel, they'll just wait it out, and then a rivalry will come in. So the two things that can happen is the Seth Rollins versus Kevin Owens rivalry will happen. Or Seth will just wait and see what happens to him. But Seth Rollins, whew, man, Seth Rollins has had a rough 2019. At first, it started out great with the Royal Rumble, then Mania, and then after that, terrible title matches, terrible bookings, losing the Universal Championship, and now losing at Survivor Series. And he called my queen trash. Not trash, like he called my queen not competitive, like at Survivor Series. He called my wife. Charlotte Flair, not good. I'm like, what? How can you do that, Seth? That's the one thing I hated. That's the one thing that I was like, nope. Nope. But Seth has a face. It had a good run. But it had to end soon. So I think Seth as a heel has a better chance to get people to say, like, you know what? Seth is done with this whole thing. You know, I'm, I'm kind of happy. But to me, in my opinion, I feel like Seth as a heel is good. Like, it could restart him, like, as a new, fresh character. Like, no more Mr. Burn It Down. No more Mr. Beast Slayer. That's over with. I feel like he'll be something new. It'll be something new to bring him. Like, you know, he'll no longer be the top star, probably. He'll no longer chase the championship, the main titles. He'll probably be involved with Fuse with face superstars. But we will see what will happen in the future. In my opinion, I feel like this heel turn for Seth Rollins is good. Like, it's good for, like, storylines and bookings. But, you know, it's a good thing. So, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.